Can you believe France is so petty? The coups that swept across Mali, Niger, and Burkina Faso have dealt a severe blow to France because the military juntas and people of these countries have made it clear that they have had enough of France's imperialism and paternalism towards them and want France gone. France, dissatisfied with the way things are going, has chosen to escalate its feud with Mali, Niger, and Burkina Faso by withholding visas for these three African countries. As a result, Mali stopped its visa application center in France, and French citizens may expect to be denied Niger visas even when the country's borders reopen. Separately, French nationals intending to enter Burkina Faso must use the government's e-visa webpage. But that's not even the height of the clash between France, Mali, Burkina Faso, and Niger. This clash between these countries has spilled into the performing arts world and caused indignation amongst artists. It all started on Wednesday, September 13, when France's Ministry of Foreign Affairs ordered, through a letter, subsidize French cultural structures to cease all collaboration with three countries in the Sahel where coups have been carried out in recent months. This message, sent by the General Directorate for Cultural Affairs, DRAC, to cultural entities that rely on their services, such as national theatre and choreography centres and national stages, was transmitted to the Ministry of Culture Secretariat. The letter read as follows, all cooperation projects carried out by your establishments or departments with institutions or nationals of these three countries, Mali, Burkina Faso, and Niger, must be suspended without delay and without exception. All financial support must also be suspended, including via French structures such as associations. Similarly, no invitations should be extended to any nationals of these countries. As of today, France will no longer issue visas for nationals of these three countries, without exception, and until further notice. In simple terms, it means any artist from Burkina Faso, Mali, or Niger is no longer welcome in France. When the all-powerful National Union for Artistic and Cultural Enterprises received the letter on Thursday morning, September 14, the union denounced the letter and described it as threatening. They also said that something like this has never happened before. In their own words, this obstacle makes no sense from an artistic point of view and is a major mistake from a political point of view. It is quite the opposite of what should be done. This policy of banning the circulation of artists and their works has never prevailed in any other international crisis, from the most recent with Russia to the oldest and most lasting with China. So, the question is why is the conflict between France and these three African countries different? What has the coup in these countries got to do with the artists in these countries? It's clear that France just wants to be petty, and probably this is just a way to get back at Mali, Burkina Faso, and Niger for the rising anti-French sentiments. This fact is made clear in some of the statements in the letter, which read as follows, there have never been Russian attacks against a French embassy, and the order is not a freezing of artistic cooperation, but a freezing of the development aid policy, which would be made for the benefit of the coupist, which we do not recognize. The security conditions are too degraded. The Ministry of Culture further stated that the Ministry of Foreign Affairs issued similar directives to all ministries for distribution in institutions under their authority. According to media accounts, the action impacted African students as well. Seeing that lots of artists condemned this move by France, French Culture Minister Rima abdul Malek came out to say that France does not intend to ban all forms of cultural cooperation and explain the move by stating that visa issuance was suspended in the three African countries due to the inability of our services to continue processing visa applications. Security conditions are deteriorating. There is no question of stopping discussions with artists, she insisted, adding that all those who already have visas and who have tours or shows planned will be able to come as planned. We never boycott artists anyway, she stressed, adding that there is no boycott, no reprisals. In addition, Rima Abdul stated that this is an adaptation to an extremely deteriorated security situation, which is particularly targeting French buildings and French teams in these three countries. This statement again proves that France is only trying to get back to Mali, Burkina Faso, and Niger. As of now, 
There has not been any response from the military junta of these countries, and we can only wonder what will happen next between them and France. What are your thoughts? Do leave your comments, like, subscribe, and share this video.